Hi, welcome back to Outdoor Gear and Skills. I just want to do a quick follow-up video on my fire pit here uh, that Jackson built. With all the rain and everything that's going on and traveling, this is actually the first time that we've used it. And uh, tonight we're making tinfoil dinners. So again, Jackson just took three paver stones and went, uh, I believe it was 10 stones around. Uh, made a good sized fire pit. So turn around and show yourself. So he's the one that made this. We've been working on this for uh, kind of a long time waiting to do this. And so we just made our uh, tin foil dinners. So we've got a couple base of sausage, which is awesome. Carrots, potatoes, celery, uh, corn on the cob. Most of these I think we had wrapped uh, in tin foil three or four times alternating. Uh, so the seam is kind of, you know, covered over the next layer of tin foil. Uh, we cooked these for about 40 minutes. We didn't do a great job of timing it. About 40 minutes. Um, one of those isn't quite done, but so we just needed to do a little bit better time of managing the clock on these. Um, but this is really a, a fan favorite in our house. We love doing it outside. Uh, we love doing it when we go camping up at Tokety every August. Um, we throw a lot of different things in here. We have done hamburger in the past, you know, ground beef and just thrown it in, but it's a lot easier just do hot dogs or calabasa sausage, uh, just cooks better. Chicken, you know, chicken chunks you can do, but you gotta be really careful with chicken so that you're not eating raw chicken, getting it all done. But, so that's, uh, you know, just something that, you know, it's a great night. It's, uh, today it was somewhere in the neighborhood of about 60 degrees and sunny, no rain, uh, great night with us, you know, home to get back in there. And the stuff we don't eat, we just throw out for our little dinosaurs over here that are running around and not that little dinosaur right there, but the 30 dinosaurs that are running around. So it's a great way to get outside. You know, I was just talking to a few people today that, you know, a lot of people don't get outside anymore. You know, we're too busy indoors. Kids are playing video games and doing stupid crap like that. And, you know, you need to be outside and uh, it's good for your mental health, good for your physical health. So let me know what you put in your tinfoil dinners. Love to hear, you know, how often you do it, what kind of stuff you put in there. And as always, thanks for watching Outdoor Gear and Skills and we'll see you out there.